Even if you miss, you'll land among the stars. Norman Vincent Piel. We have been learning about the phases of the moon and outer space. There are eight phases that our moon appears to have. The moon reflects light from the sun. The position of the moon and the earth determine the phase. Alright, which phase are you telling us about? I'm doing the new moon. The reason my Oreo looks like this is because it's not receiving moonlight. I mean sunlight. Which phase are you doing? I am doing the waxen crescent. The reason my Oreo looks like this is because only this portion of the moon is getting the sun's light. Good. All right, which phase of the moon are you talking about? First quarter. The reason why my Oreo looks like this is because only half of the, the moon gets sunlight from the sun. So this side doesn't have a sun, but this one does. So that's how the light is bouncing off. It reflects light. Okay. All right, which phase of the moon are you going to tell us about? I am talking about waxing gibbets. That means that it is more than the first quarter. But uh, anyways, one quarter of the waning gibbous does not receive sunlight. Alright, which phase of the moon are you telling us about? I'm saying I am learning about the full moon. Full moon, okay. There's the full moon. And what can you tell us about the full moon? The whole near side is getting light. The whole near side is getting what? Light. Light, okay. Okay, which phase are you showing us? Waning gibbous. Waning gibbous. And what can you tell us about waning gibbous? Um, only a small portion of it is not receiving sunlight. Yes, a small portion does not receive sunlight. Good. Which phase are you doing? Third quarter. Third quarter moon, okay. And why did you choose to set your Oreo up like this? Because only half of the moon gets sunlight. Yes, only half of the moon reflects sunlight. All right, which phase are you doing? I'm waiting for this light. And it's a small portion because it's only getting some sunlight. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 